Hey there, how are you doing? We welcome you all to the hands-on impressions video of the build 14393.3 that Microsoft has pushed to Windows Insiders in Fastry. It is the latest build and as you can understand from the naming, uh, the build 14393.3 is a cumulative update build over the RTM build 14393. So when we talk about the RTM build, it's about the anniversary update that is going to be released on August 2nd. So uh, these builds like starting with 14393 so one of the variant of that build will go out as the uh, anniversary update release build so we have seen this in the case of threshold 2 so uh, 10586 was rtm build and we have seen like the latest uh, release is 10586.494 so <clears throat> this uh, 14393.3 is the first cumulative update release build so and now let's just evaluate it so one thing has to be kept in mind since it's a cumulative update build so it would not bring any new major feature or significant uh, new thing but what it brings are like number of fixes and improvements so there are a few things <clears throat> like uh, there were like some issue with the bluetooth so surprisingly uh, microsoft has not uh, talked about uh, fixing the bluetooth issues so there are still some issues with the bluetooth when you try to connect even to other device uh, which is running the same build you may face issues so uh, let's say that if i have a, a lumia 640 xl and i try to connect to some other device which is running the same build 14393 you may still face some issues in connecting and as we have said multiple times we don't think the ui uh, for bluetooth is quite good actually so currently it got uh, paired easily because i have done it uh, some uh, while checking i did it but there are some issues so let's see actually but here it uh, has happened because as i said i did it earlier but uh, many times you will face issues so it's not very consistent kind of experience with bluetooth so microsoft has not fixed it in this uh, build 14393.3 which is clear from the change log so it's no uh, fixes are available there and there so now apart from this uh, with 14393 we say that we face some issues with the store uh, in installing or reinstalling apps if you do a hard reset and you try to reinstall then obviously you, you face issues but we have to say that on this build particularly the store is behaving in a much better way so the installation of the updates apps etc is working quite good so we have not uh, faced any issues yet if we'll face we'll let you know but till now it has worked just fine coming to installation experience it's quite fast actually the build uh, offers very good installation experience so kind of we did not face any uh, issue so it took around let's say 30 to 35 minutes on all of our devices for the build to get installed uh, data migrated restarted everything so it was done in 35 minutes so quite good actually it uh, augurs well for future when the uh, anniversary update will be released <clears throat> now coming to how the build behaves so it's quite fast actually very responsive and it has to be because if you see the build 14393 i mean we did not have any issues with the performance and responsiveness per se <clears throat> so 14393.3 obviously is also expected to be as good Just send it to the background as you can see the navigation is quite good actually very smooth we did not have any issue so <clears throat> now we'll uh, talk about the multitasking part and obviously we will uh, do a bit of gaming so that we can understand so let's open two games two better than one so 
Let's open the subway surfer and we can also open the railway. So this game is optimized for Windows 10 mobile. <laughs> we will also open one more game which is not optimized for Windows 10 mobile and we will just check. So let's send that to the background. We will open one more game. Let's go about Rail Rush. send it to the background now let's check uh, we can actually do bit of youtubing video so we will check them all together that will be fun so let's do something good so star trek So let's send it to the background so you saw the video playing so it's good actually you can watch videos without any issues there's no issues with uh, i mean scrolling i mean going forward moving forward going uh, back etc it all works fine so let's now check the multitasking part so we have enough uh, apps open like games also two games we have open so let's quickly check them as you can see the subway surfer always resumes so well Let's check the other game which is not optimized for Windows 10 Mobile. And as you can see, I mean, it has still, I mean, we can say that it's still decent actually, that it has, it took not that much time. But usually, if you talk about the games which are not optimized, they took, take some time, there is a bit of lag, but that's fine. I mean, uh, that the developer need to uh, work out how to do it. And here we are. So that's VR, there we are, actually we uh, can see that <clears throat> the multitasking works quite well, even with two games open here in the background, we can see things are like, I mean it's, it's all working fine for us. So uh, with that we come to end of this video, okay, we can, we should not miss one thing for sure and which is. Uh, let's step, talk about the uh, battery part. So the battery uh, wise, I mean, 
what we can see is uh, even much better like the battery discharge rate is going lower it's as good as you will have on a windows phone 8.1 device yeah we can say you say that because here you can see the two hour 31 percent two hours 48 but but uh, point is if you uh, what we are getting uh, in terms of battery life is quite impressive for any device so if you, even if you have a very heavy use uh, your device will last as good it lasts on any of the stable windows phone 8.1 builds so i mean with that we come to end of this video and we can tell you that the build really uh, is impressive in terms of performance uh, multitasking responsiveness video watching gaming etc it works really well browsing is also good so i mean uh, only thing again like the bluetooth so uh, surprisingly uh, they are not improving it they should improve the ui should be improved and the performance should have been better so i mean hope you have liked this video stay tuned uh, for more keep watching